Hey, hello everybody. This is Brahim from Mr. Busro channel. Today we will start new tutorial series about HTML. The letter is considered as the bedrock of the World Wide Web. And if you're gonna do anything or thinking of doing anything within the web industry, it's higher it's highly recommended you know HTML. Uh, this series is going to be uh, for absolute beginners. It's going to be short and easy videos. And I am guarantee you, after uh, finishing the whole series, you will be able to develop smoothly with HTML. And maybe create your first website. So stay tuned. So let's get started with what is HTML abbreviation. So HTML stands for hypertext markup language never mind about this in a word html is a file that contains text let's call that text html code and the browsers read and display that text uh, the text or document or html code mentioned above based on tags that's all about tags so what are tags? Basically, a tag is a code uh, located between two angle brackets. And uh, each tag do something within the, uh, the HTML page. As you can see in the second bullet point, we have uh, a body tag with its two angle brackets. And we have something and another body tag. This is the structure of markup element. So we have an opening tag, then something, and an end tag, identified by the slash. Moving uh, to the next bullet point, we have another type of tags. Yet, you don't need an end tag in this particular type. This type called empty element. One more thing about the tags is something called attributes. Basically, they are special words used inside the opening tag to control the element's behavior. Oh, I don't understand. It's okay, I'm going to give you an example. Let's suppose that a car is a tag. And uh, that car has some attributes, let's say like color, speed, whatever. And uh, each car can have different value. And these value can change the car properties or the car behavior. As you can see in the example, we have three different cars. And each car is different than the other due to the uh, uh, attributes values. So uh, the major structure of an attribute is attribute name equal value. And it should be inside the opening tag. At this level, that's all what you need to know. It's okay if you don't understand everything. In the next videos, the image will be more clear and you will understand better. Uh, oh, okay, let's talk about quickly about uh, what we need uh, to start developing with HTML. First of all, you need a text editor. Uh, I'm going to, to use uh, the Windows uh, Notepad. You can uh, also use Notepad++, the choice is up to you. And uh, we need uh, a web browser, anyone, Chrome, Opera, Firefox, it's up to you. Uh, so yeah, guys, uh, thank you for being here. Make sure to subscribe and feel free to ask. See you in the next video.